right, let's do it. Uh, I have no idea who's playing or what the bracket really looks like. It's got to be Mac Pink. There are only about five or so matches before the tournament's over, so this is one of them. Nice. And it's all losers brackets, so probably losers quarters, losers semi, something like that. Yeah, so it is losers quarters. Okay. And um, loser of this gets fifth. So you said this was Mac Pink? This is not Wait, what thought it was Mac Pink. I was about to say, oh, no, no, I don't no, no, think no. Scott has... No, no. Oh, so this is Grant. So This is Zuda. Yes, yeah. this is Zuda. Pink uh, actually took out Praline. Oh, really? Yes. Wow. So we will be looking at whoever wins this plays Pink. In Loser Saturday. All right. Ooh, that's, Ooh, that's, that's rough. like Mac so far. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I, I think that the Pitcher is kind of a new addition to, to Zuda's roster. And so uh, it seems like he's been doing well so far this tournament, but we'll see if it can match up against, you know, one of CSAT's finest. Well, he doesn't oh, have a that's, uh, yeah. that's He rough. thought he did. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's rough. Uh, feeling up the neutral here. Honestly, it's all pretty even. That PK fired. It's a, it's a really solid neutral tool. Stop to the jump. Ooh, that was so good. Yeah. He knew that, he knew that he was going to match that side B. Yeah, exactly. Because you're, you're so antsy when you're off stage with, I mean, either Pyro or Mithra, honestly. Yeah, you do not want to be off stage as Pyro Mithra. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But uh, Zuda, especially since he plays Little Mac, definitely just wants to side B. He's That's not used true. to a side B that actually goes far enough That's to where his point. opponent can hit him uh, uh, yeah. immediately. But uh, <laughs> yeah, unlike Little Mac side B, this one's actually like punishable. It's crazy. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Right. Very punishable. If you just shield it, it's like minus 40 or something yeah, ridiculous. Yeah. And it, you don't even have to shield it, you can just jump over it too. Yeah, so. just full hop, uh, violet down air, rest in peace, Fargo. Yeah, <laughs> true. <laughs> so true. Yeah, I mean, I, I get to really like how... Uh, oh, 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 wait, wow. that was actually so around. good. That was good. Yeah, I was about to say, I really like how Zuda's kind of keeping space, uh, keeping keeping uh, Ness out here. Yeah, he's That's really made this comeback. It's completely even, and he's still got center stage. Yep. Ooh. Oh my gosh, the, Dang. the Randy Ike looking yeah. dash tag. Look, where I, that thing is so big. It's actually crazy. It's so yeah. Too. It's Ike's is probably better than Pyro's, honestly. Yeah. Uh, it's like lingers more. Yeah. And also catches you more off guard because like against the Pyro Mithra, you're like, oh yeah, Mithra will dash tag because uh, it's like really fast. It covers so much space. Yep. yep um, yep. and then you're like just weirded out that Pyros is so much slower. Yeah, yeah, it's um, true. But I mean, like, it, it does, like, accomplish kind of the same thing where it kind of catches your dash back, so, I mean, yep. both or, pretty good. Or you're just waiting to do nothing. Like, right. if, you, if you try to play too reactively against a Mithra, yep. uh, I mean, a Pyra, trying to get a kill, oh, you God. might just hit a dash tag. Yep, yep, yep. Ooh, almost had that. Uh, interesting, interesting. I mean, that move is, like, not punishable on shield, so I understand kind of <laughs> yeah. going for it a lot. That being said, like... Uh, maybe maybe a little bit suspect. Oh, good neutral tech or like neutral get up. I mean, that's probably the only thing that wouldn't have gotten caught by that, other than roll in, I guess, by the PK fire. Gary. Wow, the prominence revolt didn't even hit the Ness's shield. Yeah, when he landed yeah. On there. I thought it would. Ooh, this is scary. I mean, this is this is the moment that decides the game. Kind of. I mean, like, there's a, there's many pyro moves that would kill here. I mean, not so much from Ness. <laughs> yeah, most of them being incredibly unsafe and will <laughs> yeah, kill her immediately exactly. if she goes. Like, if she dash tax yeah. and they shield it, it'll just be an yeah. instant L. Yep, but this character is bad, right? Yeah, <laughs> for sure. Oh, um, that could have been an upbeat, I'm pretty yeah. sure. I'm actually not sure. I, I think Ness's dash tack is kind of safe. Yeah, that's um, true. That's he true. didn't hit hits two and three, so I also don't know how that affects it. Yeah, uh -oh. and, and you have to react. Oh, that's... Oh, that's so rough. You get... Clipped by like the tail of the PK Thunder. One thing Zuda definitely needs to learn with this character is how to recover. Yeah. Um, yeah. Pyro's up is actually it's really good. it is good. It snaps. Yeah. It's a really good snap. Uh, but you have to be ready for it, right? Like you have to know to like switch and then up the like you know a little bit before right. you're gonna have to recover. You know what I mean? You can't just like kind of snap the button as soon as you can. Right. It seems like so far all he's really doing is going off stage, yeah. Mithra side B, and uh, so like you can you can pretty much tell he just wants to side B high like every, right. every single time. So yeah. and I mean, getting big punished. And, and Michael hasn't been doing this, but I mean, like we said, he could full hop and then Ness has a perfect dare for punishing that. So yeah. I mean, if he does that too much, I could definitely see that coming out in game two. Yeah. The only thing is at lower percents, since side B does go pretty far horizontally, he's not going to score any kills at like 20 or 30. Sure, 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 sure. He can start doing it around like 60, 70 if he's trying to snap ledge yep. with side B, because it does not snap yes. the ledge. Correct, correct. Yeah, it'll just kind of bounce you up and down for a while, yeah. <laughs> a while. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. I mean, so Battlefield, interesting stage pick. I know Ness really likes this. I don't really know anything about how much Pitcher... I actually don't know how much Ness likes this. I know uh, that... Uh, Mithra really likes this stage. Yeah. And Yoshi's story because of up air. And, That's true. And yeah. just random kill. It can kill at like 80 just randomly. Yeah, up air is actually crazy. Mithra up air is like weirdly strong. I guess it's like the base knockback it has. But yep. Yeah. It is. Yeah, man. Ugh. I mean, right idea to having like punish it if it was landing option, but right. a little bit late on the draw. Also, probably should have gone for something.
something safer that he could frame trap with, yeah. like uh, up tilt. Mithra up tilt is so good at covering landings and then just punishing what they do instead yep, yep, because yep, they yep. didn't actually land. That is true. Yeah, definitely. Oh yeah, really definitely. good catch. I mean, yeah, it seems like the biggest thing for Dude to work on here is kind of like his flow chart for recovering. Uh, it seems like a lot of things have been caught uh, that not weren't necessarily guaranteed. Oh, that's scary. <laughs> He, he does get the air. Whoa, I, guess, I haven't seen that move not connect forever. Yeah, they put, true. They put like mega hits down on that move specifically yeah. to make it work. Yeah. I'm so surprised that, that just he just fell out. Bless the super crazy. D DLC gets a uh, trap by ultimate as well. Love to see it. Love it. Oh, uh, that was almost good, but he didn't forward smash. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A dash attack might have even like put him in an awful. Oh. Yeah, he's trying to space around the up smash, but doesn't quite. He's, he's not turning around the right way, so he didn't grab one. It's really tragic. Yeah. I, you know he's fishing for this kill now. Oh, it's rough. Yeah, he's. He do be fishing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I mean, it's something has to get done pretty quick here, and I feel like. Oh, no. I feel like Michael's really good at kind of extending these situations. He doesn't like, you know, overextend and fish too much. He'll, he'll just kind of build his percent lead. Oh, yeah. Okay, man, it's still not killing. I feel like, uh, I, I, I don't know, I feel like there's a lot of times, I guess Max, or uh, Ness's stuff is really, like, not punishable on shield, and so, um, I, I, you can't really get guaranteed out of shield punishes like that. I know, that's, I didn't know that was a thing. So, that's not, oh my god. <laughs> And He's moving. That is crazy. But then Mac does the the nest mid mid level uh, carried shit where it's actually pretty bad and you shouldn't go for it. But it works on yeah, everyone. So work. yeah, and there you He's go. Dead. Calls out the side B. I mean, uh, I mean, he, he seemed like, like for especially that first game, he was kind of cooking, you know. Uh, I mean, he does have a sword, so it's kind of easier to keep Ness out. But I think uh, Michael really kind of grabbed onto his defensive habits and. Yeah, for sure, especially off stage. Yeah. So that is going to be losers quarters. So Michael moving into losers semis, I guess against Pink. Yep, so that's for fourth. Cool. And this then I actually... play the winner of that. Wait. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah that's right. Because um, I think I saw this is a rerun of they already played this bracket. I think they. I think uh, Michael sent Scott into losers, if I remember correctly. Yeah, I think he did. Yeah. So we'll see. We'll see.